So this is what's happening on my desk. So right here, we have the Ten of Pentacles from the Modern Witch Tarot deck. This is a manifestation card. If you wish to claim this reading, I'm going to tell you what they mean. So what is going to happen here is, if you wish to claim this reading, cash at me two 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 dollars and twenty two cents. That's it. Just saying that you claim the reading. Just putting it out into the world, putting it out into the energy, just making sure that I claim this reading. The reading is being posted anyway, and I'm just going to tell you this just to let you know that if you do it, you do it. If you don't, you don't. I'm just telling you how to manifest it. So if you want the manifestation of it, you want things to kind of, then pay attention. Claim the reading. Cash at me, two, 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 two dollars and 22 cents. The, this reading is going to be posted using this deck. This deck is the Modern Witch Tarot deck by Lisa Sterl. Sterl, I think that's her name. Okay, this card, the Ten of Pentacles. This card means everything in your life is coming together magically. No more stress-filled nights worrying about money, your rent, or your job. You've done the work required to create some stability. Your home is full of love, satisfaction, and comforts. There's no need to do anything drastic or radical, believe it or not. You found some peace and allow yourself to welcome it in. Okay, so after this, this is whoever's claiming this, cash app 222. This reading will be posted to get, we're, we're bringing this in, okay. This was already part of the black magic. This is the Empress. So this was already told. But if you're claiming this reading and today, well, if you're um, if you're claiming this reading, period. The reading was five dollars per card, which there was eight cards. As of now, I realized something different was happening and was going on, what was going on. So if you still want to claim a reading, it's still five dollars, but I'm changing it. Because for some reason, nobody listened to what I said, even about the card or about the situation. So what's happening is there's eight videos pertaining to this reading. For $10, 1010, cash at me, and you'll get the link to every one of the videos, eight videos pertaining to, this is the Necronomicon tarot deck. This has already been explained in the Black Magic video. And I'm going to repeat to you people again, for those of you that are not listening, this is not what this channel is about, okay? Black magic is not what this channel is about. But what's happening is that I'm starting to notice that all my emails that are coming in was pertaining to somebody doing something. So I'm very gifted pertaining to like helping people. So we, we practice light over here, but I am able to help some people that send me messages or send me emails. I ordered this deck for them. So people are asking me to do black magic readings and this and a third. I don't do that. This is not what this channel is about. I will, like I said, and I keep telling people I'm here to help. So when I started getting all of these emails pertaining to this, then this is the reason why this deck comes out. So this deck only comes out to help. All the decks come out to help. But this one comes out to help that particular group of people. But this is not something that I will be doing on my channel unless it, it has something. I'm doing them for a reason. So this is not just, this is not that. I just wanted to clarify, I'm helping. And in order to help, we got to know what these people are doing. So that was for that. This, this is the high priestess. This is the high priestess from the manga deck. Let me show you her. Okay, so this card, the high priestess, along with the magician, is part of the fool's incarnate self. This introverted aspect wants to explore and understand her inner self and the magic of the unseen world. She dances in the dark, mysterious corners of herself and the universe, paying attention to the invisible currents that move and shape the physical world and her own soul. She understands that there are ways of knowing that have nothing to do with the rational mind. 
and she studies and honors these ways. The mysteries of the universe are hidden, but reveals themselves to those who sincerely seek them. She is the inner calm to the magician's external action. So this is like some of you guys who are now realizing how gifted you are or how, you know, you're coming into your talents or you're just trying to experiment or, you know, you just want to, you're trying to figure out some things. This card would be for you. Same scenario. Claim your reading. 222 is going to be fully with this deck. $2.22 cents to my cash app PayPal. Going to be the same reading, going to be posted just so you know. But if you're claiming it, then claim it. You guys got to remember to start putting this, this energy out. So remember if this is all up to you. The reading's going to be posted anyway, but if you're claiming it, claim it. Um, then next we have the art card. This is from the Thoth deck. This says a feminine figure stands next to a cauldron, divine energy pouring into the vessel. A crown of sunlight radiates from her head. One half of this woman is light and the other half is in darkness. The right half emanates golden divine energy, which pours down into blue waters of the pot. The left half pours for blue energy into the orange liquid. The golden cauldron is etched with the alchemical symbols for water and fire. Sitting in front of the cauldron appears a lion and an eagle. The yellow circle behind this woman displays the motto of the alchemist. Visit the interior parts of the earth. By rectification, thou shalt find the hidden stone. Okay, this means construct the elements of your life from opposing elements. Meaning where you guys are talking about this, you know, like I just said about the light and dark magic. We practice light energy over here. We practice light everything over here. But my learning and my teaching... I don't know if that makes sense, but either way, my development came along meaning I had to learn everything because growing up, if you guys know the story, if you're new to the channel, I would already said a couple of things, you know, I gave you guys, you know, some information about who I am and how I came into some of these things, but learning to control both elements is very important. You have to have balance and in the Bible, God said, let there be light. Meaning there had to have been some type of darkness pertaining to that. So if you resonate with this card, same thing from everybody else. There's going to be a reading. Nothing but this card. It's going to be this card, number one. But it's going to be with this deck as well. So if this reading resonates with you, same thing. 222, cash app. You claim the reading. It's going to be posted anyway. So only God and you know it. It doesn't matter. The reading's gonna be posted. It just I wanted to make sure that while we're manifesting, because people are asking me for different readings, different things, all of this stuff. And I'll take the time to do it. I don't have any issue with it. I just want you guys to get exactly what it is that you need from, you know, what you're asking me. And as far as everybody that has donated already, I really appreciate it. And yeah. These readings will be done 